hello, time yes to roll. Welcome, 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 babies. If you're new here, welcome back. If you are returning, come on in, get your shit, get your shit, get your shit, and get comfortable. Because we're about to make you do what it do, loves, okay? The smoke detector will beep. The planes will fly. I sing. I curse. If any of that is a problem, now is the time for you to click off. If not, come on in. Stay a while. Like, subscribe, comment, share. Don't forget to click the all button if you're interested in personals, any of my other channels. Um, contacting me or buying any of my products, all my info is in the description box. This is a this is a divine. I don't know why I cannot talk. This is a divine connection channel. Somebody want harmony here with you guys, okay? Um, somebody may be sending you messages through music. I feel like someone wants reconciliation here. They could also be listening to spirits, to spirit guides here. They're being guide, guided back towards you. Birds may be significant. A gazebo may be significant. Roses um, or a rose garden may be significant here. Yeah. Somebody sees that this connection with you is abundant or they see you as abundant. Yeah, somebody got hope. They're hoping that you guys can be fruitful. And I really do feel like this person is listening to their spirit guides here. They're hoping that they can plant some type of seed and you guys can grow into something that becomes very fruitful. They want to transform the situation with these butterflies here. I feel like this person is sitting back there praying. And they're being guided by the light here. Yeah, this person is trying to ground themselves. They're trying to center themselves. They may be doing a lot of self-reflection at this time. This could be you or your person, guys. Yeah, they want someone wants to surrender. They're trying to change. They're going through a transformation at this time. I feel like whoever um this is, they could have been bound, stuck to something, felt like they were chained or, or connected to something they could not release. And now they're finally surrendering. Give me one more for this divine connection. Give me two. Yeah, you could have walked away or someone is walking away from something. Someone is surrendering. They're going towards their happiness. They're listening to their intuition. Someone could be sitting at home and they could be by themselves and they're really in their head. They're listening to their intuition. They're being guided here to release, to make these changes. And I feel like they're praying for happiness, for balance here, for harmony. Yeah, and they're, they're gathering their strength. Dragonflies may be significant. They may see you as a star here. Okay? But I feel like they're gathering their strength to come towards the star. I feel like you're the star. They want harmony with the star. You may be in the spotlight. It could be just their, their eyes are on you here, focused on you. This looks like a wand. Someone could have did some type of magic here. But I do feel like someone is coming towards you. They're gathering their strength to come and have harmony here with you. And they're listening to their intuition. What's going on, her spirit? Yeah. I do feel like their ancestors have stepped in. Could be some grandparents here. Our great grandparents that are um, giving this this person guidance at this time, that's giving this person hope, that is guiding this person towards this light here. They're getting downloads, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. To surrender to the new beginning. Someone maybe find out they're pregnant as well. There may be a new beginning. This could be giving birth to a new beginning as well. But someone is surrendering to the new beginning. They're listening to their ancestors. They're ready to go through this transformation or they're going through the transformation. Tell me more about this divine connection. Yeah, they're constantly thinking about you. I'm telling you, someone is sitting at home and they're constantly in thought. They may be sitting outside. They may have a patio or um, because it's trees and stuff. So they're outside, but I feel like this is their house. I feel like they're sitting at home. They could be watching the birds, but they are getting some type of download, some type of intuitive messages here. 
about surrendering, about making these changes. These two pillars here make me feel like someone had to make a choice. So they're in thought about a choice. They're indecisive. I feel like this is the two of wands here. But I feel like it has uh, it has something to do with their heart. The heart decision. They have to make a choice about some type of heart. Love TKO. Yeah. And, I, and it's like I said, this new beginning could be in love here with you guys. Let's start all over again. I think I better let it go. Huh. Somebody feel like they, they, they lost out. They're centering. Another love. TKO. Somebody feeling like they may have lost again in another connection or they could have ended something. This is divine masculine. Feeling like they need to let it go. They could have let karmic go. And now they're surrendering. Because they want to come have a new beginning with this divine feminine. They can't get you out their thoughts. Yeah, they're healing. Time to take control of your love. Love to control of me. Uh, they get out of nature. My thoughts and sense of time and have a change of mind. See, this is a lot in the nature healing. They're taking the bumps and the bruises of a two, uh, all the things of a two time loop. Yeah, they're going to come out and talk to you. They want to express, but it's after the transformation. They're, they're healing their feelings. I think I better let it go. Yeah, they had a choice. Maybe they made the wrong choice in the past or they're stuck in a. In a I'm telling you, they're sitting outside at home, and they're thinking about this decision, what choice to make. But I feel like they're listening to their intuition. They need to let something go. Maybe they need to walk away from a house situation, a home. You know what I'm saying? It's time to walk away. They got to let it go, and they're praying for the right direction here. Their intuition is telling them it's time to make change. It's time to surrender. Go towards a new beginning. Their ancestors is telling them it's time to go towards a new beginning. It's time to release. Yeah. They have to let something go. If they want to make this change, it's their ancestors, their spirit guides. God is telling them it's time to surrender. It's time to let go and to head towards this new beginning. Yeah, there's someone out here general. This is a marriage here. This is a connection. They go to three birds again. Oh, you love, love to control me. They try to take control of your love and love took control of that person. They tried to, they tried to, uh, they were stuck in their pride. Yep, now they got to change of heart. They didn't went through the bumps and the bruises of all the things of a two-time loser. They tried to hold on. Their faith was gone. It was just another sad song. And I think I better let it go. What are we clar clarifying this with spirit? Uh, it looks like another love. TKO. Let's see who, um, they just need their money. Somebody need their money. I feel like that was the karmic. They letting it go with the karmic, right? And they coming towards you for this divine connection, soulmate divine connection, divine feminine. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I do feel like they're letting something go so they can come have harmony with you. They're, they're getting their courage up. They're making a choice. They're walking away from something that they've thought long and hard about, that they've prayed over, that the ancestors are leading them and guiding them, and they're surrendering. Okay, and they're coming towards you with this new beginning. Let's clarify this. Divine connections. Somebody got beat up by love, though. I feel like they got beat up by love with this karmic, and that's who they letting go. They want harmony. They want peace. They've had enough. That shit is it's time to let that shit go. It's TKO. And they making the decision to let it go. Let it go. And they hoping they're making the right decision. Clarify harmony here for my divine connection. Yeah, see, someone could be younger. There could be an age difference here. Someone could have been very childish. Could have been acting very childish, and now they want to come in and balance the situation. They want to bring harmony. Can I find this hope? Uh-oh. Yeah. See, they were being childish. They were out here cheating third parties. Okay? And now they're hoping that they can uh, move forward here with you. Should I find surrender here? Yes, yeah, spirits is believing this. So they're surrendering. They're releasing this childish playboy, playgirl energy here because they want to come towards you. They're surrendering. They they miss you. They miss being in your arms. Yeah. Ever since you walked away. Clarify this freedom. Clarify freedom. 
so I can make shots. Yep. Because they realize it's a soulmate divine connection. Love. Okay. So many things they want to tell you. Believe in this connection. Verify strength. That you will look at me. So they're afraid that when they come tell you the truth, you may look at them differently. The first moment I saw your face. Yeah, here comes Divine Masculine. So Divine Masculine may be younger than you, man or woman. Just the masculine energy here. Yeah, but they want to try. The ancestors is telling them to come towards you and try. To try to fix it here. After they're surrendering. Try for this new beginning. Because they feel there's no you without them. Clarify new beginnings here for this divine connection. That's too many. Let me see what it was. Trust yourself. Look at it from their point, point of view. Sneaking around. Abuse. Hurt. Male side piece. Trust me, baby. Yeah, so they want to come back and fix it. They're hoping you guys can get past it and have this new beginning. They may feel like you moved on to somebody new as well. That could be what's keeping them stuck as well. They don't know if you're dealing with somebody else. Because they put you in third-party situations. They do not know if you're going to treat them the same way they treated you. But I don't feel like you are. That's why the ancestors is telling them to go try. That could be fear. Uh, fear could be what's holding them back. Because they're in their heads. Okay. That's our new beginnings for these divine connections. That's still too many. Yeah, look. <laughs> you mean the world to me? Abuser, abuse. Hanging out with family and friends, male side piece. Yeah, see, they hanging out with their friends. They think you with somebody else. I just shuffle these cards and put them back all in different spaces. If they pop out again, we're going to take them, y'all, okay? They're afraid to come towards you for this new beginning because they think you're dealing with somebody else or they think that you feel like they're still dealing with a third party. Okay? They still have fears. They want to come back towards you with no doubts, no fears, no questions. Clarify new beginnings for this divine connection for one card. They still gave me three. Okay, well, three is less than what it was, okay? Yeah, so you walked away, right? You said it was time to say goodbye because you was not going to be a part of this, right? Now they want to come towards you because they want you. They want this. They want us. They want the connection, but they're trying to find the right words. They don't know how to come tell you. They're afraid. That's why they're still stuck in their thoughts, okay? Because they, they were childish. They were immature, Okay, they were in this playboy, playgirl energy. I feel like they could have hurt you here. That's why that abuse came out. Yeah, you could have been loyal to them the whole time because you knew it was a, a divine connection here. And now they're in their thoughts about how they treated you. How do they come back towards you and tell you they want this connection with you, that they want to be with you, you know what I'm saying, after being so childish or acting so childish, after putting you in third-party situations, even though they want to try, you know? They could be afraid you're going to say no. You're going to walk away. You may not believe it. Clarify thoughts when it comes to these divine connections. Yeah, but you are always on their mind. They can't stop thinking about you. I told you, they're sitting out here and thought, thinking about you. Thinking about this connection. Trying to figure out how do they come back towards you. What is the right words? Because they do want you. Yeah, you walked away. They could be walking away from another connection to come towards you as well. It says, I'm leaving. You need to leave. Let's have a baby. Let's rekindle the fire sneaking around. So this person could have walked away from you and went towards somebody um, that said they were pregnant to rekindle the fire and to find out this person was sneaking around. Or this person snuck around with this person behind your back, made a baby, right? And now they want to come back. This went while they were out here being immature and cheating and shit, right? Now they want to come back and rekindle the fire. They don't want you to leave. Yeah, they want to renew the love here with you. Divine connections. Sometimes love goes astray. Through all the ups and downs. The joys and hurts. Love. They want to get past it. Yeah, look. Whatever happened to third parties, it was just sex. They want to rekindle the fire with you. Yeah. They know you're taking time to yourself to heal. You could have turned your back on this person, listening to your intuition. You're trying to heal your heart, all this green here. You were hurt. This person caused you a lot of pain. You see these storm clouds? There's a lot of emotions. Yeah, you had to work on some shadow shit here. 
Okay, so this person could have triggered you emotionally. You had to heal something from your past, some shadow self here. Now your person is working on healing their shadow as well. I feel like you guys are mirroring each other. Yeah, this person lied to you in the past. But I feel like you have been very patient with this person. You might have even known they were sneaking around. You probably knew that they were lying. Now they want to come back towards you. They want to ask you to marry them. Um, possibly want to get to a commitment first, and then marriage is the long-term ending, okay? Um, spirits is listen to your intuition. For some of you guys, this person is coming back still in this negative ass low vibrational energy. For others of you, they have done the work. They've been actually out here healing. So please use discernment when they come towards you. Who the someone is. Okay, so let's do the someone is for this divine connection. Look, it says, um, I cut on someone is finding peace, releasing demons, shadow side addiction, bad habits. Oh, and it fell out. I guess it's supposed to stay. What was that behind it? Um, yeah, see, someone was saying they're single, but they were in a connection. This could have been them when they were being childish and dealing with a third party here. He, she cheating. So I'm keeping them. They fell out. I'm keeping them. Now they're finding peace. They're releasing whatever this energy is. They could have released the third party. Karmic energy, right? Yeah, because they're setting boundaries here with family, friends, karmics. A mom, a dad, a baby mama, baby dad, besties, cousins, karmic energies, karmic exes, okay? So they are releasing and setting boundaries with these people. So if they were in a third party, whoever the other person was, they are now setting boundaries with these people. They are finding peace. You see, in the past, this person was not ready for marriage or commitment. They were still doing third parties. They were being manipulative. They had narcissistic behaviors. They were being childish. And now they're releasing this. Okay, it turns sideways. Let's see what this is. Yeah, so someone, this could be you or your person. They could be about to get another job or promotion. Open that business. Increase their business. So somebody's money could be about to pick up. Money could have been a factor. When it comes to this third party situation, right? Maybe somebody needs to get a job. This is why they were holding on to this person. Or maybe why they were holding on to the third party. Whoever this is they setting boundaries with. They could have told these motherfuckers, you need to get a job. Okay? Or you need to get a promotion. You need to do something because I can't financially take, take care of you. They set boundaries with these people. They're getting peace. Yeah. Maybe your person is about to receive some type of large sum of money here. And these people were holding on to this person. For the money. They were trying to keep this person in this childish lower vibrational energy. And I feel like your person is now seeing the truth. Yeah. Somebody's all in their head about you here, Collective. They can't stop thinking about you when it comes to this divine connection. Yeah, they were super confused. This person was super confused. Because they were listening to these family members. They were listening to these friends. They were listening to these third parties here. Okay, and they had them all up in their fucking head when it came to you. They didn't know what to think, what to believe. That's why that person's sitting outside all in thought. But they're finally listening to their own thoughts, their own intuition. They're, they're no longer listening to these people that tried to keep them in confusion. Because they now realize that this person or these people were keeping them in confusion for money. It was all behind money. All this is behind money. Yeah, now your person ready for marriage or commitment. They see the truth. They're no longer confused here. Hours and hours, okay? Yeah, somebody been lying and putting smut on your name. Whoever these family members is, is shit. This is why your person was all up in their head and confused. Okay, you walked away from this person. This person is hurt that the relationship is over. Okay, and they want to come back. Now, whoever they put boundaries up with... These third parties, they're now hurt because your person is no longer dealing with these people. They 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 put boundaries up. Yeah, this person's coming to see you. It says tonight. It may be tonight is the um new moon and the eclipse. It may be happening tonight. It says they're coming to see you tonight, babies, okay? If they don't come see you, maybe they're coming to get um you reach out to you. Somebody's expecting a baby though. New baby on the way. Yeah, somebody was cheating and their person knows about you. But you didn't know about them. That's their third party. Okay? That's that third party. Third party could have said they were expecting a baby. And it, it belonged to somebody else. They were cheating. Maybe this is what they're coming to tell you. Maybe this third party was cheating and was pregnant by somebody else. And the third party that they were dealing with knew this person was pregnant by them. But was over here still dealing with your person. 
for others of you guys. Um, your person was just cheating with this third party, right? You may be pregnant by your person. They may come to see you tonight. Um, and they're finding out that they were in a third party. But they're coming towards you to be faithful, loving, and kind. When I met you, I knew this was it. They're doing whatever it takes to make it right with you, okay, babies? Yeah, whoever these third party was, they was envious and jealous of you. Something's going to happen great for you in the next six days, love. And when they return, they're coming back ready. They're dealing with karma. Good if they were good, bad if they were bad. Put it where it go. Yeah, someone was dealing with you, an ex, a baby mama, or a baby daddy. And family and friends, okay? They was all jealous. Yeah, they were lying. Or they found out their person was lying. Their family was lying. Yeah. This person's been hiding their true feelings and intentions. These family members, these third parties have been hiding their true feelings and intentions. Bad motives. Karmic energy. The person's found out. Now they're ready that these people have been lying the whole time. Causing confusion and 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 um drama in y'all shit because they were envious and jealous of you collective. Let's get close to home. Yeah, somebody about to come um to you. You about to get that new place. Maybe you and your person about to move in together. Or if they live in another state, they're finna travel to you. But it says a house, move, an apartment. About to get that new place. Okay? So they coming to, to, to build something here with you. Bottom of the deck says, and they coming to tell you the truth. They ready, and they telling the truth. So if it resonates with you, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, my loves, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Mwah! Bye, TT babies.